Hi, I'm John Chapman. I don't normally fold my hands like this, but I'm going to do it so you can see the movie poster of our family wedding. Not ours, because we're not married, and it's probably a lot of people looking at this, and you don't even know who I am. But anyway, I'm at the Lewis Lincoln Square in New York City for the world premiere of America Ferrara and Forrest Whitaker's new movie. Stay tuned as I interview celebrities, and I promise I'll hold it to one mustache question. So one last question. What's the worst wedding you've ever been to? Um, I know it. And it's funny, one of my guests here was involved with it. It was snap, the wedding was fine, yeah. but someone acting up like to the point that it could be in a movie. Really? It's so not funny when you see it in real life. You're like, dude, you're really doing that toast, you know? You're doing the toast. <laughs> the Zach Galifianakis toast in the movie. Nice. Yeah. Um, so I, I got a clear memory of a bad wedding. Yeah, you want yeah. a name drop right now? I can't because he's here with me. <laughs> Good ass. It's Every guy has a hard I don't need to have a bad premiere. <laughs> Good luck, man. Thanks, man. All right, thanks. Yeah. Nice to meet you. you. So let me ask you first of all, uh, I know that you, you're in this movie, but you still get stopped from the Korean dynamite? Like you have to, right? <laughs> I do, yeah. yeah. And I'm always very humble. <laughs> yeah? The Fonda was the best thing that's ever happened in my life. So yeah. thank you. So I never get tired of talking about it. Like, yeah. The whole movie, the cast, everything. Yes. All right, so let's only talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to know about Keisha? No, time. tell me tell me about, you play uh, Forrest Whitaker's sister, right? Yeah, so. I play his sister-in-law. Oh, um, sister-in-law. Yeah, um, Warren Sapp is his brother, and I'm married to Warren. We okay. have two kids, so. I do a ton of Right? Sorry. Uh, I have some pop, so. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I do play a sister in law, which is so humble and so exciting. So uh, it's just a great fun, great cast. Lance Gross is great. Regina yeah. King, amazing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, America, easy. Carlos, I mean, just a, a, a cast of really funny people, you right. know, in spirit and in humor. Naturally, was written, yeah, yeah, yeah. writing great, directed by Carly Rock, was amazing. Right. Charlie Murphy, you know. But it's so hard, like, because romantic comedies get such a bad rap. Because nine out of ten of them are absolutely horrible. Sure. So this I mean, is going to be different. Okay. Yeah? I'm, well, Tell I'm me how. Because I'm have to sell it. Sell it right now. Of course, our family wedding is going to be different than any other wedding. Because A, the father, A.K.A. Sean Paul Avery, is in it. <laughs> B, Charlie Mercy is in it. C, you have Forrest Whitaker, who is an Oscar winner. <laughs> Do you need any other reasons why? And then you have Ugly Games. American Fire. There you go. Right. I'm going to see you right now. You should see it right now. Can we go together? Probably not. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Best of luck. Hi. I'm John. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So talk to me about the movie first and, you know, playing a mother. You look too, too young to have I'm going to just take that compliment. Just take Thank it. You enjoy much. it. I'm going to walk with it. it. Um, but I know that you have a TV series, too. Come on, right? Talk to me about it a little bit. The series? Yeah. Um, I am starring in a new series with Fox called The Good Guys with uh, Colin Hanks and Bradley Whitford and Jenny Wing. Okay. Uh, there's, you know, uh, two cops, one, two detectives, one old school, doesn't trust DNA or computers, okay. gut instincts. The other Bradley one, Whitford. Bradley Whitford, okay. young guy, uh, Colin Hanks, like whippersnapper, uh, you know, itchy trigger finger trying to raise the ranks a little too quickly. So they've been paired up to be to babysit each other, but ultimately they have what the other one needs, and together they're a great duo. Okay. I'm their lieutenant, they drive me crazy. Nice, I bet off screen and on screen? On, off screen, it's a battle of quotes from movies, and I can't really? even get in. The two of them are shouting out one thing, they pick up, you'll see the scene, the shoot, the, the scene uh, cuts, and they're off into the next quotation. I can't even get my quote. Who's your inspiration for this character, play, playing the mother? Who's my inspiration? You know, my grandmother has that kind of martyrs woman okay. in her. Uh -huh. It's all about the children, the family first, and you know, and forgetting about yourself because it's about making everybody else happy. Yeah. But it, it's nice because the audience gets to see Sonia go and reclaim her happiness. Which right. Is, which is right. Good luck with the movie Thank and the TV show. Thanks. Thanks. I'm to work with Ross Whitaker is the biggest, you know, biggest thing. I didn't know about everybody else. I just knew about Forrest Whitaker. Yeah, yeah. What? I could be in the movie with Forrest Whitaker. Yeah. Then I seen the rest of the cast: Michael Corral, Lance Gross, Carlos Messina. I mean, uh, Tate Diggs. I, that made me really the more confident. That was just something that's good. Well, let me ask you about Forrest Whitaker. Is he a director on the set too? Because I mean, he's no, no. He was just he can, he he can shut it off. He was just an actor. Yeah, man. Yeah. Is there a particular role that, that you haven't had yet that you think? A shot? I actually like that. You ever yeah. seen me in the love scene? Yeah. No. Okay, yeah. that's my point. That's all. <laughs>
hands on you. See, so they they afraid. See, they afraid. Show me. I know. I'm like, it's always kind of strange. By the way, too intense for people. <laughs> You ever seen me anywhere? Yeah. It's all this. I mean, wait, so. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I can't understand. Like, what you're talking Ticket being so awesome? Wow. I never really looked at it as just being so awesome all the time. You don't yeah. know me in real life. No. So, <laughs> that, that would be a no. No? I, I enjoy the awesome moments. You enjoy the awesomeness? <laughs> okay. So, uh, Moving from TV to, to film and all this stuff, yeah. you prefer one medium or the other? You know, or where the good work is. All you know, the material, right? Yeah, you know, I mean, I was just saying down there, you know, not always what it started out on paper. Sometimes the fi final product isn't as great as you thought it might be, right. but the intention from the beginning is, okay, I can, I, I, I'm receiving this. this. This is good. This is something I want to see. Right. Do you have one particular role that you play that just is totally personal to you that... More so. um, For me, it's two two seven. I'm ah. sorry. I'm sorry, but. Woo wee! That was blast I... from the past. <laughs> um, you know, I really. This sounds corny. I love everything that I've done. Yeah. I wouldn't have chosen yeah, to do the roles or even audition for them if I didn't. But um, a Lifetime movie I did with uh, um, Harry Connick Jr. called Living Proof, where I played a cancer survivor. Mm -hmm. That that one was really close to me because I had these four people. That have been in my life, two of them who aren't with me anymore, who, um, fought cancer, yeah. breast cancer no, 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 specifically. Yeah, yeah. So, um, and then even more who just had to battle cancer um, outside of breast cancer. So that one's special. Cool. Yeah. And what about this one? This one's special to me yeah. because it's an incredible cast and it's a heartfelt movie with comedy. So you're not too heavy, you're not too light. Cool. Yeah. You are awesome. Thank you. Uh, any sibling no. rivalry between you and America during the movie? Uh, no, well, in the movie, hey, yes. yeah, but in yeah. real life, I don't know. We were, we hit it off from the beginning. It was almost weird. Yeah. Like, such sisters, literally, like, you know, teasing each other, ripping with each other. Like, I'd punch her in the boob, she'd credit card me. It was amazing. It was amazing. Wow. So you punched America for our own boob? Yeah. yeah. And vice versa. Really? Oh, okay. It was good times. Yeah? Any it's of that make the movie? Stuff. It's sister Did stuff. that make the movie? Well, there is a scene where we are slot boxing each other. That yeah. didn't make the movie. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry. about uh, building chemistry so easily with America for... Uh, you know what? It, it was really easy because we hit it off once we met. I mean, we have like this brother-sister type relationship, so we just had to bring the romantic element into it. But uh, we're both actors, and, and we, I think we did a good job. But yeah. America's great. I mean, she's like family to me. Yeah. Now, is a little part of you worried that you're now going to get a lot of scripts for similar romantic comedies that aren't quite as good? Uh, well, you know, you always have the right to say no. But, right. I mean, scripts on, on your table isn't necessarily a bad thing. Right, right. Yeah. So you do a couple of bad ones and then a couple of good ones? Uh, hopefully a couple of good ones. <laughs> uh, all good ones. <laughs> Let me ask you a quick question. Um, you have a goatee now. Would you ever yeah. support just a mustache? Just, um, just a mustache. Yeah, because Forrest Whitaker does it. Uh, I might, I might, yeah. depending on... Not that on, you have to do what he does. Yeah, 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 no, no, depending on the role that I'm playing, I might have to, yeah. but, uh, but yeah, yeah, I probably would. Yeah. What do you have next? Like uh, well, I have more episodes of Tyler Perry's House of Pain coming okay. up, and nice. I'm, I'm definitely focused on my film career, so that's on the horizon. Cool, man, good luck. All right, thank you. All right, thanks. All right. We have to go in. Hey, okay. okay. Hey, man, how are you doing? Okay. Okay. How's it going? Right. How are you? Now, I'm guessing you get like a lot of grandmother roles offered to you. What what stood out, you know, in this role for you to take it? It's a good script. Yeah. It was a fun script. And that's it. I mean, okay. you know, you make a. I mean, this, once the script is good, you make of it the best you can. Yeah. I mean, I've made chicken salad out of chicken. chicken. Oh no, I've seen it. So, <laughs> <laughs> so I mean, the yeah, best. So you know. You know. Well, well, could you, 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 you say it in English and I'll say it in Spanish? I don't know I'm scared if I tell him to say something. Then I, don't I won't, I promise. You promise? Exactly I'm just you're telling him to go see the movie Our Family Wedding. Vayan a ver la película Our Family Wedding. You're going to see this amazing guy, uh, Carlos Mencia. Van a ver a Forrest Whitaker. Van a ver a Lupe Ontiveros. And uh, you're going to love it. Full of heart, full of love.